Hey y'all. Today's video is brought to you by the EA Creator Network. I'm not getting paid, I just got a code. Make sure to use code Vixella at checkout when using the EA app or thesims.com to purchase any Sims 4 content. So today we are checking out the Sims 4 444 rent for the very first time. As soon as you open up the game, this is what we're hit with. Property management. Property owner Sims can be present living among their tenants or they can live in a separate residence while generating income from their several property investments. Landlord. If they don't keep their unit ratings high, they could face a tenant revolt. Oh, spicy. New lot type in town, uh, residential rental lots with multifamily dwellings. Give your Sims a basement suite to rent out, create a duplex to keep two families closer, even build apartments. Oh, there's gonna be so many options. I wanna build some townhouses so bad. I love a townhouse. Closeness and create harmony or drama. Sims and residential rentals will get tangled up in each other's lives. They'll socialize at potlucks, meet in the garden, and have opportunity to discover each other's secrets by eavesdropping and snooping. Love to snoop. She didn't hear that from me. Explore a new world that's alive with possibilities. Visit the botanical garden and discover an animal sanctuary. What? Oh, there's a night market. Oh, fabulous. Okay, we're gonna jump into create a sim, look at the build, check out the world, and then maybe like dip our toes into the actual rental process and see how that works. So her name's going to be Renty, uh, Rentington. Let's sort by for rent. Okay, so here are the hairs we have. Oh my God. <laughs> It's giving Edna mode <laughs> from the Incredibles. No capes. Oh, and then they have this one with like the different color underneath. Hold on, wait a minute. This looks awfully familiar. Oh, this one I love. I love like the wave. I like that one a lot. And then we've got the short curls. We've got, oh wow. We've got like a low braided bun with a scarf or a ribbon or something tied into it. That's really, really gorgeous. And it changes colors. <gasps> How cute is that? Oh, stop. that is adorable. Look how stinking cute that is. I love that one. Hey, a long hair. We hardly ever get those, I feel like. That's pretty. So like sleek straight. Okay. This might be my favorite one. That is so cute. I don't know, I really like all these hairs. Oh, I actually don't know which one to go with. <laughs> I think we'll go with this one. Oh my God, it's such a hard choice though. Cause like, it's so cute. Well, let's see if there's any like, oh, okay, wow. Let's see. We have two new hats. Oh my gosh, look at the little tie in the back. That's so cute. And it's got a bunch of really nice colors and some solids. And then we also have this one. It has a belt on it. Cute, and it also comes in solid colors. It also looks like there's another one here requires handy person career. Interesting. I'm so happy that there's jewelry. You have no idea. Okay, we've got a couple of new earrings. Okay, the little strands of hair are kind of blocking this one, so I'm trying to I'm trying to get a good angle. It's actually difficult. We also have these, which are easier to see. We have these, which are so pretty. We also have these glasses. I love round glasses. I just think they're so cute. We also have this necklace, which is very pretty. I can see myself using this one all the time. And we also have this one, which is also really gorge. I'm gonna give her these two because they match. Okay, so let's check out some of the clothes. Here are all of the tops for the girlies and a few that need to be unlocked. Purchase this object at the night market. Wait, that's sick. Collecting all the tassels in Tomerang and then another night market. Very cool. Okay, here's the first. Oh, it's got buttons in the back. Cute. Oh, and this also changes. Cute. And then we have this one. Also cute. I love the colors of this one. Oh my gosh, how cute that is. Oh, I love the pattern on it. Oh, I like that swatch. We also have this one, love the pink and blue. It's like my favorite color combo. Actually, I don't know, that one in pink and green. Those are kind of my faves, very cute. This little number, very cute. This one, this one, love this one. I love that pink. We've got this one, ooh, that's nice. We've got this one, which I think that's like, yeah, it looks like two pieces. <laughs> love the pastels. Oh, that is really pretty. We have this one. Wait, that's sort of, hold on, we're matching. We have this one. There's actually a lot more than I thought there was gonna be in here. We have this, we've got this. Kind of speed run now. And we've got this one. We still have to look at the bottoms and the full body. <laughs> okay, so let's put on something short so I can see like all of the bottoms. Okay, here's what we have at the bottoms. Looks like the, sort of the same amount. We've got these shorts. These are cute. Ooh, the colors on these are fabulous. Does that match? It's oh. close. <laughs> Wait, these are kind of cute. This would normally not be my thing, but like kind of like those. We've got these. We've got these, which are very cute. I love the tie. We have these. It's sort of throwing me off. The pockets look like they're meant to be on the back and, and they are. That kind of threw me off for a second, but almost feels like a mistake. I'm sure it's not, but it, at first glance, I thought it was. Okay, these are really nice. I love a high-waisted short. We have these. We have this skirt. Oh, it comes in solids and the stripe. We have these. 
and we have these. Very cute. Now let's check out the full body. A good selection here, to be honest. All right, here's the first one. It comes in pink, so I'm happy. Here's the next one. This is cute. Yeah, I like that one. We Whoa, where are you going with that tool belt? Is this a handyman thing or whatever it said? Handy worker? I forget what it was. Oh, how cute is that? Oh my gosh, look at that purple. That is gorgeous. This one. Oh, they have different logos on this. This looks like something somebody who works at an apartment building might wear. I'm not sure. Maybe that's what they're going for. Oh, wow. How, oh, how gorgeous is that? This one as well. It also comes in solid colors and some other prints. Pretty. Oh, wow. Look at that. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I'm loving all the pinks here. Oh, th see, these colors rock. This one, I love that they all come in pink. Oh, that's cute. Oh my gosh, I love. Wow, that is gorgeous. And the last one we have is this, which is stunning. That is stunning. I'm lo I love the florals. Like, I, oh. And then we also have this one, handy person. That's what it was. Interesting. Ooh, I don't know. I think I like this one. Like, I just love it. Oh, and all the colors are so pretty too. It's a hard tie. I might go with this one. Oh, it's so cute. We do actually have some accessories. We have this bracelet. We have this one. And we have this one. Oh, it's the same on both hands. Whoa. Okay, there are so many shoes. Hopefully we can see them all. Whoa. Wait, wait, hold on. Do those match? Oh, they're really close to matching. We've also got these, which are great. Always good to have a new pair of sneakers. I mean, like, look how, like, I love that. We also have these. We have these, which I sort of sworn we had something similar to this already, but maybe I'm wrong. We have these. And last but not least, we have these, which are very nice. In fact, I think I'm gonna keep those on. Gorgeous. All right, moving on over to the men. Let's see what they've got. Here's the first hair. Very nice. Here is the second hair. I actually kind of like this one. Typically, I don't usually go for this, but I kind of like that one for some reason. And then this one, which I love this one. This one's really nice. Only three for the boys. Wait, but did they get facial hair? They did. Oh, okay, not bad, not bad. Actually, I kind of like that, that's nice. Accessories, they got the same necklace and glasses. Hats, they got this one. Ooh, wow, look at these clothes. Wow. That's really nice. This one, also super nice. This one, which just removed the necklace entirely. <laughs> I've got the tank top, which is great. I like that one a lot. I like the stitching pattern on that. Oh, and I like the colors, hello. Again, loving this one too. I love the texture of them. We've got the tank top, very cute. It's like a layer tank top. This one, beautiful, gorge, love the buttons. This one, again, very, very nice. These are all just like so classy, aren't they? Ooh, these are so pretty. Pink and blue, love it. Oh, that one tucks in. It's nice. I like that detail. We have another sleeveless one. Oh, this is interesting. We've got another layered one. And we have this one, which I think looks similar to one that the ladies got too. And then we also have three here that need to be unlocked. As for the bottoms, we have these. We've got these guys. Another one of these. A lot of shorts. A lot of shorts. More shorts. More shorts. Okay, we're getting a little longer now. Oh, these are the ones that look like they're backwards. Some more shorts. The Sims 4, four shorts. More shorts and some pants. <laughs> so many shorts. <laughs> One outfit for full body. Okay, so I think it's the handy person like uniform thing. I don't know, I'm just making a guess. I genuinely don't know. Okay, they got the same accessories and the same shoes. Now let's look at aspirations. Okay, I think there's four new aspirations. We have the seeker of secrets. The Sim loves the thrill of discovering juicy secrets about other Sims. What they do with that information has yet to be decided. Next, we have the five star property owner. This Sim wants to be the best property owner the world has ever seen. We've got the fount of Tomorani knowledge. This Sim wants to immerse themselves in everything Tomerang has to offer. Discerning Dweller. This sim aspires to be the perfect tenant and neighbor in a residential rental. Interesting. I'm going with five star property owner. <laughs> Yeah, let's get this bread. Okay, I think we have five new traits. That's quite a lot. Okay, so there are five new traits, but one has to be earned. And I'm pretty sure it can only be earned by elders. And that is the wise trait. Now, how do you earn it? I don't know yet. But we have the child of the village trait. They love feeling anchored to their community and Tomorani culture. Keeping in touch with loved ones and engaging in activities that remind them of home is important for being happy. We also have the cringe. We have the cringe trait. I have to see the animation for this. You know, that worked. <laughs> that was extremely effective. Sims who are obnoxiously oblivious and oftentimes met with polarizing reactions. 
Cringe sims can be socially unaware of their surroundings at times, but have an adorable enthusiasm for life. Wow. That is such a backhanded roast. Backhanded compliment. He's also generous, caring, empathetic, and patient. These sims are happiest when offering their time and money to help others. Everyone loves generous sims, but they can be a little too brazen with their donations. Aww. <laughs> oh, cute animation. We also have Nosy. I love the nose. That's very nice. Sims who thrive on gossip, snooping, and spying. They have incredibly poor boundaries and don't quite understand what personal space is, but they will discover secrets by any means necessary. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> the binoculars. No, it's good. That's good. It's good. I also didn't see the animation for this one. Oh, the lantern. Oh, that was cute. See, so yeah, Renty Rentington is going to be cringe, generous, and nosy. I'm sorry. She has to be. Did the kids get anything? Oh, kids did get stuff. Does sort of look like a lot of these are just like size down versions of the uh, adult outfits, except for a couple. Some of these are different. Cute. The kids clothes look really, really nice. Okay, yeah, these are similar. And then we've got these two, which are really cute. And new shoes. Stop. Look at those. Look at those. Looks like they also got the same hairs. That's really nice. And is it the same for the boys? Yes, 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 yes. Oh wait, this one's different. I like that. Okay, same here, same here, nothing there. Same shoes, okay. Oh my gosh, look what the infants got. Sorry, I mean toddlers. I said infants and I go, they look a little big to be infants. Cute. Oh, cute. And the girlies, same thing, same thing. Oh, stop. That is so cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, oh my gosh. So cute. Now we will look at infants. Is that a banana? Oh, that's so cute. Oh, these are precious. Cute. They even got a bunch of little tops and bottoms. I love it. And they got a hair. Now that I've looked at everything and created Senna, let's move on to the build stuff. Oh, and the world. Tomerang. Let's go, let's go, let's go. What the heck is it? Turn on residential renting on board. What's this? Welcome to Tomerang. In this close knit neighborhood, you can join fellow tenants or even become a property owner to run your own residential rental business. Let's dive into the details during this onboarding. This might actually be helpful. I assume it's like a tutorial, which I'm gonna be honest, I think I need it. How to become a property owner. I don't know. I, I wanna be both. Let's do a tenant first. All right, select a lot. I'm gonna be a tenant first. You gotta walk before you can run, okay? Choose from the available unoccupied pre-made homes. Okay. Oh, okay, so it's like apartments, but they're like houses. So cool. Oh, and it has a rating? Not very good. Lease length is seven days. Furnishings are 7,000, so I have to pay for that. And then this one, four stars. Furnishings are 15,000. It has mold? How can you be, how can it be four stars with mold? Well, I, I think I'm gonna move in there. I'm just gonna have to deal with the mold. Daily rent is $65. Okay, yeah, we'll do furnished. I'm like nervous for some reason. I wanted to look at the build stuff. I've already jumped into the gameplay. I'm doing this all wrong. I got distracted. Oh my gosh, like how gorgeous though. Well, let's check out the world though. Look at this. Ooh, cute. All right, now how much of this is functional? Put your money where your mouth is. What can we do here? So obviously this is our house. Oh, okay. So it's like apartments. So we can't see into anyone else's section. This is our little section. Wait, this is so cool. Oh. Are those new counters? Those look really nice. Okay. Hey, we have a radiator. A fire safe. I would never turn that on. I would never upgrade it to fire safe. I like fires in The Sims. Okay, we got some bunk beds and another bedroom. Cute. Oh my God, we have this little like porch area. And it looks like it does go upstairs from outside. So is this someone's, oh, that's someone's unit? It's huge. Okay, so what else is there here to do? Okay, we have a lounge here. There's a bridge. Oh, comes across to this. This, a sanctuary. Wow, look at that. Whoa. So we can support, adopt a tiger? What do you mean? What do you mean adopt a tiger? Well, I'm sorry, but I have to click that. I don't even know I, what's going on here. Welcome to the Cub Club. Thank you for your generous donation towards the adopt a tiger program. Every cub needs a fluffy friend. Be on the lookout for your plush buddy and an exclusive com commemorative, com commemor I can say this, commemorative poster. Cool. Sneak in. Can only be performed under the cover of darkness. Oh my god. Okay, is there anything else going on over here? Is it just those couple of things? Because as cool as that is, it's not much. I mean, people are like walking through here, but none of these buildings are real. Oh, they're really cute. This is, okay, this is an empty lot. So that's nice. Oh, we can go to the beach. We can swim. Okay, sweet. I do like that. I do like that. I love that little beach. Beautiful water to swim in. If you can really go. Can you really swim that far? It's still going. Wait, there's like multiple beaches. Hold on. That's kind of sick. Oh, I found more. Break in? <laughs> Oh my God. 
EA said you guys want burglars so bad, you do it. Okay, so that's a residence. It's so cute. Okay, so that's fake. <gasps> hey, collectibles, rags to riches, let's go. Okay, so there is more than I thought. You can fish from here on this little dock. You can also swim like all throughout here, which is really nice actually. I love the little secret beaches. That's very cute. Oh, you can fish from here too. It's kind of a maze to figure out where I'm going, but okay. Before we do anything else, I'm going to go to manage worlds. I want to see all of the objects. I saw a little glimpse. I want to see the rest. Okay, so we're over here. I think I'm gonna pop in over here so I can check out this part of the world too. Because obviously this is like very lush, very green, and this looks more like the city. Oh my, okay, so we're gonna have a look around here in just a little bit, but I see like a park and stuff. Okay, I'm liking that. Okay, so here, let's start with the pre-made rooms. An outdoor wet kitchen. Oh, so tiny, I thought it was gonna be big. This is cute. Oh, we've got like a nice hose. Oh, I love the plastic chair. Check out this fridge. I think rocks. Love these cabinets. Love that. Love this shelf. Love the door. Love this rug. Cute. Okay, next we have a kitchen. Ooh. Oh, this is pretty. Oh, okay, I'm seeing, I'm seeing a couple new objects in here. Very cute. Okay, next we have a bathroom. Okay, so this one's actually interesting because in this pack they have squat toilets. Now, I personally have never used nor seen one of these before, so it will be very interesting to watch my Sim use one. I have never seen it before, but like, look how nice all the plumbing stuff looks and this plant is gorgeous. Look at this, beautiful. And the tile, I mean, keep Round of applause for the tile, it's gorgeous. All right, next we have, is this like a living room? <gasps> oh my God, I love this freaking chair. <laughs> <gasps> that end table, that lamp. This, ca I can't, I love those. Oh, look at the curtains. Oh, this is cute, this is cute. And we have a spirit garden. Wait, let's check this out. Oh, this thing is big. Wow, look at this bench. Wow, that's gorgeous. Oh, I love the color green too. Spirit house. Okay, I'm definitely gonna have to watch my Sims use that to sort of understand what that's all about. Oh, that's so exciting, it's so pretty. Okay, so let's do some of the build stuff first. So I'm gonna put down some walls. Okay, starting with the doors. We have this door, we've got this door. Oh, it looks like an like elevator. And then this one. Okay, so they're all short wall height. <gasps> Gotta love a pink house. I mean, door. What about this one? Ooh, the colors are nice. And then this one, they're gorgeous. I mean, look at that, so pretty. Oh my God, look how many windows there are. This is so cute. It'd be so good for a bathroom or something. Whoa, that's such a fun shape. We also have this one. I love the glass on it. The secret maze window. I see you. This one's huge. I love any window that has shutters though. I really like them. Look at the detail. The lotus, it's gorgeous. Oh, they have the ones with the slats. Very cute. Patient in pastel. Oh wait, I skipped one. Shuttered in pastel. Wait, no, I skipped a couple. Hello, what am I doing? This one, fantastic, gorgeous. We've got the small shutters. We've got something, something pastel. <gasps> that is the most perfect shade of pink. Oh, get out your not so berry challenges. Look at that mint. Oh, look at this. Is that stained glass? I think it is. It's gorgeous. I love stained glass. Oh, we've got the medium size ones of this. Okay, so it looks like we're getting into just different sizing now. Uh, let me go back over here and get rid of some of these. Okay, we've got this one. That's a gorgeous window. Like, that's a really pretty. I'll, I'll use that one for sure. Look at that. Oh my God. And then we've got this one. We've got the open shutters. Is this another pastel? Oh, I love the pastels. Man, these are tall. Okay, so they, they go all the way up to tall. So then they have this one too. Gorgeous. Oh, that got a little crowded there at the end. There's way more windows than I thought there'd be. Oh my God, there's more. <laughs> They have very tall, the tall, tall versions of them. <gasps> Stop, they connect perfectly as well. Oh my God, we got different sizes. Ooh, different shapes. Oh my God, how cute is that? We also have a wall mounted air conditioning unit. We also have these, gorge. They're super pretty, I love that green too. And then we have these like, I don't know what these are called. Kind of like fake balconies. Got a couple of those. We're on top of the roof, a solar water heater. That's a non-functional. This is a functional one. Fully operational, cool, I wonder how that works. We've got one of these spire things. We've got one of these things. These all go on the roof of your house, by the way. We've got one of these and one of these. For columns, we have three and they're stunning. These are all really, really nice. I can definitely see myself using all three of these. Look at the spandrels. Oh, bye-bye. We also, ooh, 
Ooh, we also found one too. That's gorgeous. Dude, there's so much stuff here. Okay, we've got some fencing. How gorgeous is that? Comes in a bunch of beautiful colors. We also have this one. We also have this one. Whoa, that's tall. That one. And we've got this one. These are actually so good for apartments, which I assume is why they did them. They're like privacy fences. That's super smart. And they all have their matching gates. That gate. Holy cow. There's a new staircase. Look how pretty. It's got designs on the side. There's a new flow lounger. Wait, what? It's got oh, the elephants and the little palm trees. Look at the tiger on the pineapples. I love the tiger one. Oh, it's got like a little head for us. That's cute. Wow, wait, look at these floorings. Love that wood floor. That is a nice wood floor. Ooh, and then we've got some tiles. So these are like patterned ones. So you kind of would want to like rotate them. Oops, see how I didn't do that one right? There you go, gorgeous. Wait, there's so many patterns. Oh wait, there's some that you don't have to do that on. There you go. Okay, so you can choose to do it with the border or without. Same with this one. Oh, I love the blue. They have this one. God, they're stunning. Like, oh, I love that tile. Then we have, do you believe in concrete? Wait, what the heck is happening? They're changing. I don't know why, but this is reminding me of like Animal Crossing QR codes that I used to download in New Leaf on my DS. I'm literally obsessed with these. They're so cute. That's so fun. And then we have like a stone path, which this is gorgeous. Okay, I am so happy with every single flooring that came with that. That's stunning. Now for wallpaper. Okay, we've got like five. Okay, we've got like the wood wall. And we've got a couple different variations of that. And then we've got stucco in basics and pastel. Ooh, okay, good. Some good solid colors. This is actually really helpful. And then we've got painted patterns. That's right up my alley. That is so cute. Oh my God, I love that. Oh, there's a new roof texture. There's two new roof textures. These are so pretty. I don't have a roof yet. Okay, there is also a new foundation. There's a lot of stuff here. I think I got everything. I hope I did. Now for items. Whoa. Okay, holy moly. Okay, let's delete. Well, let's just move this wall. I'm sure I'm gonna need it. Okay, first thing we got, this beautiful canopy bed which is just gorgeous. We've got the most uncomfortable stool ever. Oh, this is a stool. I thought it was a table. Cute. I, I just, I don't know why I love the aesthetic of this. Like how cute, how cute are these little guys? Oh, this is also like a little stool. And then I love this chair. I think this chair is gorgeous. We've got the dining chair, also gorgeous. We have this dining chair. We all know the Sims loves chairs. They love a chair. We've got a bar stool. It's a nice bar stool. We've got a couch with pillows. We've got a bench. This is a beautiful bench. Like it has a cushion. How cute is that? Look at the pattern on it as well. It's gorgeous. Oh, okay, kitchen counters. This is the island. Check out some of the swatches. Look at those countertops. Isn't that pretty? Ooh, I love that. Then we have the same here. And then we have the upper cabinet, which I'm gonna go stick on the wall over here. Cute. That one's got a paper towel holder. We've got the corner one, the little one. Oh, it's got a basket in it. The inner corner one, that one's really cute. And the other end. Oh, and we have the tall one. It's got books in it. Cute. Okay, this is a dining table. We've got a little small one. Another dining table. It looks like they're meant to go with like each of the chairs. Cute. An in table. How gorgeous is this in table? Ooh, I love that. And this one too. This is the one I saw earlier that I nearly peed my pants over. How gorgeous is that? Poppy table. These are really pretty. I will definitely be using like all of these. We have a shelf. I'm pretty sure we saw this one in a couple of the pre-made rooms. They also match the kitchen counter. So if you ever want to just like squeeze those in, they work. I'm pretty sure they're like the same swatches. They are. Is that a pink detail? I'm impressed by the swatches. They actually match. Now this is cool. It's a bathroom cabinet with like a towel on it. And I'm wondering if you can put stuff on top of it. Look at this vanity table. Oh, so that's a mirror. Oh, that's gorgeous. And it's so much smaller than the other ones we have, which I love. And then we've got this sink, which I just think is precious. I mean, look at the detail inside the sink. Isn't that gorgeous? I love all the attention to detail here. It's really, I'm really liking it. Oh my gosh, this is a baby potty. It's the chamber pot for babies. Oh my God. Okay, we got the squat toilet. We have two squat toilets. I'm trying to figure out. Oh, I put that one down twice. So one is just a little fancier than the other one. Got it. We've got this gorgeous shower with beautiful tile. A hot tub. Wait, that's a sick hot tub. It's a hot springs. It says almost natural. That's cool. Jar for marbles. The perfect display for a collection of marbles. It doesn't have any marbles in it yet. Get out there and find or win some marbles. Oh wait, that's really cool. So can I put stuff on top of this? Absolutely. Oh, and some of them have stickers. Golden ticket marbles game ring. 
cool. Oh my gosh, it has so many swatches. Shut up, that's so cute. Okay, we've got a bar with beautiful, beautiful details. Drink tray, oh, that's what this was. Sugar cane juice drink tray. How cute is that? Look at the market craft stall. Oh my God. Can we use this? Vegan vittles? Don't know what that is. Late night snack dessert stall. Rice to meet you. What? Can we use these? That would be so cool if we could. Hopscotch. No way. It changes. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up. And they have a long one. That's actually so cute. Here's the spirit house. Okay, we were looking at this earlier. It has stress relief. By leaving fruit and incense as a gift, one can soothe not only themselves, but also those around them, living or dead. Interesting. So you put like an offering in there. The green is by far the most beautiful, in my opinion. I just, that color green is like one of my favorite colors. Okay, we have an electrical fuse box. Back to business. Okay, we got one of those. We have a pink one. One, a water heater. There better be a pink swatch in there. What the heck, dude? No pink water heater? What kind of world are we living in? Bob the plant. Okay, these are cute. Bob can go right there. Wow, that has a lot of text. The flightless bird of paradise. These are gorgeous. Look at the pot. The default one. I love that. The unhatched bird of paradise. This is gorgeous too. Yeah. Sunlit garden fern. Oh my gosh. And I love that they're sitting on like a riser too. It's like so elegant looking. So pretty. These are nice plants. <gasps> Okay, I'm fine. Wait, this is free. Oh, to dirty up the walls. I got it. Oh, we got some grime, some rot, some fill, some yuck. Okay. Clouds of crud. Oh, there's more. Lucky mountains. Got that drip stain. Here we go. Sooty spots. Dripping drops of dross. That's great. Okay, now back to this. We've got a tapestry. Oh. Ooh. Shut up. These are stupid. Stunning. We have the mirror. This is so pretty as well. The hardly suspicious curtain rod. Right. Oh, you can put them with these. How cute is that print? I like this one. I like the way it's like tied up at the bottom. Like, isn't that cute? It's got the same prints as that one. And then we've got the different heights. Yeah, you know how it goes. Um, lemonade sign. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, is that ramen? Wait, there's so many different ones. The tiger. Oh my gosh, cute. For rent sign. Uh, this is for, 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 for rent. Nobody loves mushrooms like a gnome. Oh, he's got the mold disease. Yeah. Non-functional water heater. Oh, this one's just for funsies. Is there a pink one? What's wrong with that? Okay, we've got the dish rack. I don't know why these are so cute, but they are. Oh my God, I love the pastel colors. Tactical tiffin? You know, I have to be honest. I'm not totally sure what this does, but I will say that it's a really, really cute object. I love the patterns as well. A wedge cushion. Oh, I wish you could put those on the couch or something. Oh, never mind. I'm mistaken. Perfect for relaxing on the floor. Well, then stick that bad boy on the floor. Oh, well, then now look what I've done. I move objects did and now it's permanently stuck floating. Bird jail. <laughs> Bird jail. Is there a bird in there? Can we get birds? Basketballs. I really like those. I think that's super cute decor. Save the elephant's teapot. Oh, mortar and pestle. Cute. I'm actually surprised we didn't have one of those before. Ceramic vessel. Gorgeous. Oh my gosh, look at all the colors. Oh, I like this one. The welcome mat. And it's only $30. Ooh, a lot of swatches. Okay, belief in yourself mini rug. Okay, I'm running out of space. Okay, I like the leaves. Oh, I like that. That's cute. We also have the beach vibes rug. Oh, that's cute. Okay. Yay! They made a big version. Thank goodness. Okay, so now we have radiators. Usually these go up against the wall, if I'm not mistaken. So we've got like a classic, a chipped one. This is an extra wide and an extra wide chipped. Okay. For rent wall sign. Wickered whims. You guys think you're so sneaky, don't you? Gorgeous. Take your dang shoes off. <laughs> That's cute. I like the name of that. Impenetrable security gate. Is that functional? Oh yeah, no, look, it is. A little like shuttered fake window. White lily wall art. Okay, I'm gonna have to go to the back. Gorgeous. Whoa. Oh my God, that's so pretty. Non-functional electric box. Okay. Limeware platter. <gasps> oh, oh my gosh, that's gorge. A shop sign. Whoa, that thing is big. Oh my stars. Shining tint of light. Does this thing light up? It's got lights in it. It's pink. Pink, 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 pink. Well, let's put it to the test. Oh, cute. Oh my God, 
That is so cute. We've got a divider. We've got a back bar. Oh, okay, so typically you kind of lay it out something like this, I, I think. Kind of goes behind it. Isn't that gorgeous though? If you had enough room in your kitchen for one of these, that thing would be so sick. A food stand. Wait, it's like, like proper going to a market vibes. Like it's so cute. And you can also change what's in it. It changes the veggies and stuff. It's so sick. I love that. A tuk-tuk. <gasps> it's not functional, is it? Environment one, not functional. Can you imagine? I don't know what this is, but I am obsessed with this. I wish it was functional though. <laughs> the land market. Um, this is gorgeous. This is gorgeous. Does it also light up? Shut your freaking mouth. It does light up. Wait a minute. Wait, what the heck? Honey, I shrunk the tuk-tuk. It's a toy for kids. Thought it was gonna be like a, like one that was like half this size that kids could ride. Dang, I got my hopes up. A candle, a candle, candle <laughs> alert. I need, I need a table. <gasps> that is probably my new favorite candle. That's stunning. I love that. Ooh, we've got like a, like a lantern. I'm like out of space over here. Oh, here we go. Gorgeous. And then this lamp, new favorite lamp. Hands down, that's my new favorite lamp. It's it's the perfect lamp. This is a wicker fish. Oh, I see it. That's a fish. I feel bad. I mean, I'll look at these. I hardly ever use lights that aren't, you know, that one light, but these are pretty. I do like sconces though. I use them outside a lot. What else do we have? Oh, that's gorgeous. Wow. Oh my gosh. Festival of lighting lanterns. I love the colors. Oh, wow, look at that. So, oh my gosh. This is a good mini fridge. I'm really happy to have that. And you can put stuff on top. This is a kettle. You. We also have a pressure cooker. I'm literally out of room. Going back in here. Pressure cooker. Pink. This is cool. We also have gooseneck kettle. These are my faves. I just think they're gorgeous. Oh, and then I think we have another one of those small, yeah, like the space saving dishwashers. Cute. Okay, we've got the mailbox. And we've got the little one. And the even smaller one. We've got a trash bin. This is a dresser? It's tiny. Do you know how helpful that is actually? And then we've got a big tall dresser and we've got this dresser. This is a restroom, the public variety. Okay, we're almost done. Mysterious basket. Okay, this is purchased at the night market. What makes it mysterious? It's gorgeous, really pretty. Perhaps you're supposed to fill the basket? You must fill the basket. It's hungry and needs to feed. This is also a night market item. This is so pretty. Hold on, I'm going to see this. Look at that. Wow. I love the idea of like having to go to the market to buy stuff. That's really cool. Oh, Fire Boss Grill of Grilliness. Oh, kind of a scary name. Okay, there we go. All right, now I have officially looked at everything. That was a lot of stuff and I deleted some stuff. Well, I have to admit the build stuff has yet again made me a very happy girl. I do love new build stuff. I love to build in this game so much. Okay, so now that we've made a mess of things over here, let me go back to my girl Renty Renting 10. <laughs> I love that you can see the tenants and then Renting 10. It is on there. So the last thing I want to do, I want to pop on over to the other side of the neighborhood. Check it out. Okay, here we are at the park. Hey, there's that grill that I was just looking at. Not much to do at this park, but it is very pretty. What? Look at these lamps. Fringe lesson. Trust me, I don't need one of those. I already know what I'm doing. Oh my God! Wait, so hold on, so hold on. Wait, it floats? Is this supposed to float like that? All right, let's take a little looky around. Wow. This is really pretty. Is it a fountain? You think it shoots water out? Top of the hour? No. Mm. Maybe it's lights. Okay, check it out. Okay, so here are some stalls. I wonder if this is where the uh, market is. Well, I mean, kind of looks like it, doesn't it? Look at all the, like, the lanterns and everything. How gorgeous is this? See, this is cool. This is actually so, so cool. And you can walk between the buildings. This would be so fun to have your sim sort of walk through. And it continues over here too. Oh my gosh, so pretty. And you can come over here. Oh, it's an easel. Free easel? The power you're giving us. Okay, so this is a house, functional house. House. It's kind of hard to tell what's functional and what's not. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, here we go. Here's another functional one right here. Oh, this just says visit. Okay, let's go check that out. Okay, so this is a rabbit hole then. I don't even know what we're visiting. Oh, Shirley Temple. What an architectural marvel. This building's beauty and rich history. Be sure to put any sim in a good mood. Wow. Oh, okay, here we go. Here's a, like a little park for kids to enjoy. They got the hopscotch. We can play hopscotch. I thought it was just kids. Throw the rock. Oh, it's so cute. And it's got fitness skill too. Is she gonna get the rock? Oh. You fail. Yeah. Okay, so she's gonna keep playing that. Okay, so I think kids are the only ones allowed to play marbles, if I'm not mistaken. I'm pretty sure I have heard that. Okay, yeah, so there are only four lots over here. It was the one we put all the furniture on, park that we went to, that one residential building, and then this residential building, and that's pretty much it. How 
ever, I am really looking forward to when the market is open because this rocks. Opens at 6 p.m. Well, I'm literally just gonna wait around until 6 p.m. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what we have to apologize for. I don't know what she said, but we can like show empathy, give unwarranted advice, offer a listening ear, tell the worst puns imaginable. I'd like to see her do that. Embrace the cringe. Oh, okay, let's see. Oh, what about Blick Block Dance? Dude, they love me. Oh, wait, is this, this is the Blick Block Dance? Yeah, okay. Interesting dance. Rinty tries to see the best in everyone, but these vibes are just not it. <laughs> okay, it is lights. I knew it, it's like a beacon. Hey, look, some of the vendors are open. Well, this person's open. Ooh. Okay, those all look so good. I'm gonna get the chicken stir fry. Is anyone else gonna open? Oh, hello. Wait, wait, forget the stir fry. I wanna go purchase goods real quick. Here we go. A marble! Flower jar for marble. Lemon, a tassel. Ooh, another marble. A mysterious basket. Okay, cool. We can also buy local attire. A halter and a striped shirt. I'm not sure where those go. Maybe create a I don't really know. This person's open too. Ooh, garlic noodles, yum. We can also get drinks here and some different types of food. Okay, so not everyone is open, but a couple people are. Okay, here's the handy person career. So you just fix things. So you're just the handy guy. Okay, that is a part-time job. And then what if I like, you know, other loaded it a couple times. And then went buy a residential rental. Can we buy them anywhere? I mean, surely there's not any in these worlds. I'd have to put them in. Oh, wait, maybe you buy them and then split them up. You know what? We'll stay in this world. Let's buy this one. It's available for purchase. So I'm gonna buy it. Let's see what happens. Okay, hold on now. Don't get too crazy. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, okay. So this is shared space or it's part of that unit. I see. Raise platform. Yeah, no, no. Don't want to do any of that. Okay. Then if we go upstairs, okay, there really is only room for one unit here. <laughs> but it looks like if I wanted to, I could make more if I built it. So I have to assign this as unit one and then also so this bathroom is unit one. And then I guess that's their unit. That kind of sucks. But they don't have a kitchen or anything. So I feel like this shouldn't be shared, right? Like this should, this is like a one, this is like a house. Let's be honest. We could just make this a rental then. Basically I could just make this whole house their space, including the balcony. So it has suggestions on what you should add. What's this? Assign all rooms to this unit. Okay. Oh, I can see the little dots. That's interesting. So we can write how many bedrooms and bathrooms it has. Can give it good traits. It's got fast internet. That would sell me. It's got mold. There's maintenance troubles. Pretty cool. Interesting. Okay. So I sort of understand. So then if I wanted another unit, I would just simply build it and then assign it as unit number two. Got it. Okay. That's pretty simple. Oh, and there's even an icon up here. You can toggle the visibility of the unit outlines. Oh, look up here. You can totally see it. It has, it's color coded. That's the blue line. Okay. Very cool. Very cool. I'm liking that. So then how do I manage my little business here? My little rental. Oh, here we go. I can see it right here. Fill the vacancy. View agreement. What is this? Rent per day is 200. I guess you get the whole house. Lease lent seven days. Sort of trying to figure out how that works. Large, basic amenities, the environment is lacking. Maintenance is four. <gasps> we can add these as rules. No ghosts. What's this? Two is a crowd, three is a party, four are sims, and one household violates the maximum occupancy rule. We can only have three sims. I see no loud noises. Interesting, let's do no loud noises. Just add to something. You can unjustly evict someone. Interesting. You can also sell it. So to fill it, we have to go back home, which is weird. So let's go do that. Okay, now let's fill it. Select tenants. What? This is so cool. Okay, so let's definitely get someone who just wants one bed. Well, this person's offering the most. I, I guess I'll go with that one. I don't really know what I'm looking at. We did something. All right, so I'm definitely, definitely gonna have to play. Are you done? All right, definitely going to have to play around with this. Oh, I just saw her squat. So if I want to visit any of my neighbors, I'm not even totally sure I have any. Wait, should I try to break in? Don't mind me, guys. I'm gonna break in. A loading screen. Oh, <laughs> breaking and entering. Am I gonna get arrested? <gasps> oh my God. Um, it's not what it looks like. Is this your house? She's like, yeah, go on. Oh, she came in with me. Uh-oh, my about to get beat up. She might be a little too nice. I just 
You just watched me break in. Oh my gosh, so well decorated. Cute. I can spy. Let's just spy right in front of her. <laughs> I mean, girl, could you be any more obvious? She's way too nice. She doesn't care at all. I can snoop on the bed. What are we looking for? Money? <gasps> girl, what did you find? What was that? No secrets here. What do you think I could find some secrets, girl? <gasps> snoop in the dresser. No secrets here. This person has no secrets. Man, this person really does not care what I do in here. Can you not interrupt me when I'm snooping? Oh, wait, maybe she's telling me not to snoop. That's fair enough. Well, I'm done breaking and entering now. I guess I'm just like visiting. Never mind. Nope, she's pissed. <laughs> I was wondering when she was gonna have a reaction, you know? It was a little delayed. But yeah, she's mad. She's mad at us. Oh, wow, she destroyed us. Oh, they despise each other. Really, really great. You know what? You made me do this. You made me do this. I'm looking at your pores. All right, so it's definitely gonna take me a little bit of time to sort of understand like how all of this works. It seems pretty straightforward. It's pretty hands off for the most part. Like we can travel over to the unit, but I'm not sure we can really do anything. Oh, here's our tenant. Unit rating change. Oh, wait. Up. Maybe because we introduced ourselves. Oh, we have a rental section. Ask about the conditions. Blame tenants. Commend them or unjustly evict them. So can I like do inspection and maintenance? Okay, that's what I was wondering. Okay, look, we're doing a little inspection. And there's also, I noticed in the aspiration, handle a maintenance event. When a maintenance event occurs, visit the rental unit and sort out the issue. So I assume we'll get a pop-up saying, oh, something's broken. We need help. And then we'll have to come by and fix it. That's what I'm assuming. There's also handle an emergency event. What is that about? Like a fire you think <gasps> that would be so cool very cool oh my gosh look at this you can make hot cocoa coffee tea that's so cool okay so we can do inspection and maintenance like on a bunch of different appliances and stuff okay cool i like that i think that's really cool and i really 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 want to build some apartments and like assign them all and then how fun is that that sounds fun okay so i think that's where i'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this video here for today let me know your thoughts so far in the comments below. What do you think of this? Are you gonna get this? How are you feeling about it? So far, I'm loving all the objects. I think the whole idea of it is really cool. I wanna build my own apartments like so bad. Also, I don't know why I looked over this, but you can assign how much rent is. I don't know why I skipped over that. You can always raise it and stuff or lower it as well. So good to know. But anyways, thank you so much for watching today's video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Hope you're all having a wonderful day and I'll speak to you all very, very soon. Bye-bye.